Hey guys, welcome back to my channel for yet another video today as the title states I will be talking about my new palette and I'm super excited for this you guys Like usually sometimes when I spend money sometimes I regret it I don't regret this one and I haven't even swatched it I got the new Juvia's Place Sarahan palette and I decided to do this video a bit differently Normally when I get a new eyeshadow palette I just kind of swatch it and it's just like okay well you just swatched it like okay but I decided, you know, I wanted to do an eye look with this, which is why I'm like half a bare face right now. So I'm excited to use this. I haven't swatched it or anything. I just took a picture of it and that was it basically. So I was really surprised. They actually pre-released this earlier than I thought. I was having a heart attack because I noticed this Instagrammer. I love her stuff. I think it's Budget Beauty Guru. I want to say that's right and on accident I saw her post of it being live and I was like what and she posted it like five minutes ago when I saw that and I checked out so fast and I'm guilty I use Nikki tutorials uh code so if you want to correct my mistake and you're thinking about order because I think it drops on uh, when is it January 30th by the way I'm no like not affiliated with this or anything I just me personally I would prefer to use this Instagrammer's Code or Nikki, they're ColourPop cult. They're like my favorite Instagrammer for all kinds of ColourPop stuff and indie brands, of course, too. So they have a, a promo code with them, and I didn't even know that. So I feel so bad. So in the description box below, I'll put that. You know, I don't even know the people, so I'm not making any money off of this or anything. I just feel bad for using her doggone code. Anyways, so I will be doing an eyeshadow tutorial with this palette actually i'm gonna be using it all weekend because i just i'm so excited for this so today i will do a very pink valentine's day you know theme makeup and tomorrow i'm gonna do an anti-valentine's day makeup because you know i really want to use the black eyeshadow that's in this palette but i'm trying to make myself go out my comfort zone which is why i'm doing this wig i only wore once and my lips off topic just in case y'all want to skip this intro, by the way, in the description box below, I will put a marker because this is kind of long. I'm sorry. I talked too much. Anyway, so I was reading comments when I uploaded my video about the Lime Crime Diamond Crushers I got from DHK. And I swatched it on my lips and I was like, this is so stupid. But then I just realized after reading comments like, oh, you would put it on top of a matte lipstick. So to try to get out of my comfort zone, I did a little different with my lips. I put Leo from AliExpress on the bottom, which you know is my favorite. But I ombred it with a Jeffree Star Queen Supreme Lippy. I think I have it. Yeah, I do. This one that I got from either AliExpress or eBay or both or DHK in my bulk box. I have like three of these and I never used this before. So... I decided to put that as an ombre and then I decided to use my Lime Crime Diamond Crushes on top and give it this little glittery ombre effect. So I'm kind of happy with it. I was it's way out of my comfort zone. I don't like to wear pink at all on my lips, but you know, I'm trying to do this differently. So yeah, if you're interested to see swatches, what the palette looks like and I look with this, stay tuned because I'm going to go ahead and get started and stop talking. In case this video is a bit on the long side, I will post when I do swatches and the markers. In the description box below and i will put when the eyeshadow tutorial starts so you guys sit back relax and just chill with me as we talk about this beautiful juvia's place palette all right guys so first i'm going to talk about the palette itself and then while i am talking up there i'm going to be doing swatches really really slowly so you guys can see it not as fast as my previous dhk bulk buy video because i'm like really excited about this palette and i'm going to spend 20 minutes talking about it and doing the tutorial too also I will be playing K-pop while I'm doing my eyeshadow tutorial. I'm not going to really talk because the way I do my eyes, this strand of hair is like bothering me. I don't know what that is. Sorry. But I'm not going to really like talk throughout it because I do my eyes the same all the freaking time. I will show you the products and list them below. But just warning y'all, it's going to be some K-pop in there and K-pop is my life. I'm upset because I forgot that GOT7 was coming to Houston. It's the next day away I could have went. And then BTS was in Chicago and it was too far away and I found about it last minute. Uh, I'm just like all over the place. I need to see somebody in a concert sometime this year. So fingers crossed. Anyways, just letting y'all know that warning about K-pop. So this is the box itself here. Also, I'm going to link it in the description box below. They gave it a reason as to why they made this palette and what inspired them about it. And I really, really like it. It just says that it was inspired by the Wodabi festiv festivities in the Vilani culture of West Africa and they even described in the Insta in their Instagram like what each color like meant and they really thought about this palette so I thought that was pretty cool and I also noticed that she has a black lipstick and I was like whoa I like this lady I want to do her like 
whole look and they're saying how they, they like the darker colors in their tribe and things like that on the lips and then the back is just the same typical ingredients and everything and the only thing special about the box is that i like the color palette of it it's like a watermelon spring feel to it because it has this watermelon red or like kind of matches this jeffree star color actually Huh, check that out. I chose the right lippy color. Anyways, and then it has the watermelon green color here, and I thought this was pretty cool. And this is like indented. I don't know where my other boxes is to see if this is indented, but that's how that feels. So enough about the box. In the palette itself, it has a picture of the lady like they do with all of their palettes. And then it has the Juvia's here, which has a little indentation too. Nothing going on in the back. I love that it's just this nice watermelon color. And I usually don't like brights, but this is really, really cute. This is the inside of the palette here. You have the lady at the top per usual. One, I hope one day they decide to make like a mirror one. That would be pretty awesome. But anyways, this is the inside. And the colors I'm most excited for was this Chad. I was like, it's about time Juvia's made a black eyeshadow because it's like I can do any look now with all their eyeshadow palettes. It's complete because of that black. I'm so excited for it. And because I knew I wanted this black, I'm making myself wait until tomorrow to use it because I need to get out of my comfort zone and stop using the same colors. The next one I like is the Kodo and Jam Jamila because they're the nice cool tone reds and I'm going to use that today. And then I really, really want to use Wadabi, but I'm going to wait until set Sunday to use it because on Sunday I'm going to do a get ready with me video with this because it is going to be a Julia's Place weekend. And then this one is Bororo and Kia Iman and then Senegal, Zoya, Kastika, Katsina. I'm really bad at pronouncing names. And then it's Lulu and Fula. This is really, really cool really really nice and the foil i bet it feels nice because their shimmers usually are like super super smooth i just can't wait to mess with that so that is all i will talk about with this palette i hope i swatched long enough to give you guys a really good look because it is only 12 colors here and it's about $30. So it's about the same price as a morph with less colors. But I think it's really worth it. Because their pigmentation when you swatch it and when you apply it. It's so smooth and buttery and a little goes a long way. So without further ado. And I'm super super excited but nervous at the same time. Because I don't usually mess with pink. So I think for my eyeshadow look tutorial. I am going to use the color Fula with this pink as the main part. And it just. I'm like so nervous. I don't like pink. I keep saying that because I really don't like pink. Then I'm going to do Sokoto and... Jamila probably on the outer crease and I'm probably going to use Cassina as a base and I might mix the Fula with a little Bororo maybe maybe not I'm going to use that Zoya on the inner crease so now that I know my game plan I'm going to go ahead and get started with the eyeshadow tutorial of the part of this video
기억이 될지 몰라 눈치 전부 다가내 이야기 아닌 척하며 슬쩍 더 볼까 나 몰라 몰라 하면서 두 번의 계절이 너와 나의 곁을 지나갔구나 지금 이 순간 더난 네가 보고 싶구만 확실하게 이야기했어 이제 그만 
있는 내 모습을 미워해 내가 날 싫어해 그래도 난 믿어 yeah. 멀어 있던 눈을 떠내 자신에게 띄웠던 물음표 거둘 거야 그 누구도 날 무너뜨릴 순 없어 우리 만남에 부를 거 소방관은 아니지만 이제 난 진화해 다른 이들로부터 더 이상 내 모습을 찾지 않게 집중해 비춰봐 미러 그 안에 서 있는 널 믿어 I will win it all 남자 말고 이제 내게 시간 내 안에 nothing I'm doing 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 good good I'm doing 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 good good I'm doing 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 good good 나를 믿어 너 없이 잘 하고 있어 I'm doing 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 good good I'm doing 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 good good I'm doing 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 good 나름 지금 패치는 무스 finish look at the last minute i decided to add some lime crime dope on the inside the same thing i used down here and on my lips i decided to add it on the inner crease in the middle and it looks really really pretty so this is the finish look of what i did using the new juvis place saran hand palette that i'm super excited to do i will be doing another video tomorrow so stay tuned for that with me also i used today was the watermelon soda jeffrey i got from aliexpress and the dope lime crime diamond crusher i also got from dhk yeah this one was from dhk so thank you guys for watching have an awesome day night wherever you are and stay tuned for another video coming tomorrow